Joshua Meguna Meguna was born in the year 1963 in Magina village in Nyandu constituency in Kisumu County. He was named after his father Miguna Wodi Miguna who died in the year 1962. His mother Margaret was three months pregnant with him by then he grew together with his five sisters and one brother. He attended Apondo and Nyatoto primary schools in Onjiko. After his primary education he got enrolled at Njiri's High School. He also studied at Onjiko Secondary School. In both schools he was a prefect. He attended pre-university National Youth Service NYS training. Miguna Miguna joined the University of Nairobi. At the university he served as the editor of the campus newspaper and he was also the Sonu finance secretary. He became the student leader from the year 1986 to the year 1987. In November 1987 he was arrested together with some of his colleagues at the university for championing for multi-party democracy. He was detained in Comunicado before being released later on and expelled from the university. Miguna Miguna fled to Tanzania then Switzerland. He was later granted political asylum in Canada in June 1988. He enrolled at the University of Toronto where he managed to graduate with a Bachelor's of Art degree with distinction in political science and philosophy in June 1990. He also enrolled at Osgoode Hall Law of York University where he obtained a Jewish doctor in June 1993. Miguna Miguna also graduated with a Master's of Law degree with distinction from the Osgoode Hall Law School in June 2001. In February 1995 he was admitted at Ontario Bar as a barrister and solicitor. Between 1989 to 1994 he was the coordinator of the Committee for Democracy in Kenya, CDK, an exile-based pro-democracy lobby group that successfully campaigned for the repeal of Section 2A of the old constitution that had made Kenya a de jure one-party state. In the year 1995 Miguna Miguna met and fell in love with Tracy Winter. Tracy was born in Caribbean and she was a long-time resident of Canada. They welcomed their first daughter Atieno Juma at Wesley Hospital, they got their second child on December 4, 1996 and they divorced each other in the year 1998. When Miguna Miguna was on a trip to Kenya he met with his old friend by the name of Anthony O'King, his friend introduced him to a lady by the name of Jane whom he fell in love with. They got married in a traditional wedding on 6 August 2000. He moved with her to Canada on October 29. He sired a fraternal twins in the year 2001 and later in the year 2003 he added a daughter. Miguna Miguna has a total of five biological children. Miguna Miguna ventured into private practice of law in Toronto in Canada for more than a decade. In the year 2000 Miguna Miguna sued Toronto Police Association for malicious prosecution after it complained to the Law Society of Upper Canada about remarks he made to the media while representing the family of a man shot dead by the Toronto Police Service Emergency Task Force. The Law Society declined to launch an investigation finding no concerns with Miguna's comments. In the year 2004 Miguna Miguna sued the Toronto police and the Crown attorneys who prosecuted him for malicious prosecution. The trial judge had found there were contradictions in the testimonies of the two complainants and was suspicious that they have a common motive to implicate Miguna Miguna. Miguna Miguna moved to Canada in the year 1988 after he was imprisoned and tortured by the government of the late President Daniel Moy. He moved back to Kenya to support the Orange Democratic Movement Party ODM leader Raila Odinga when he was the Prime Minister of Kenya in the coalition government. He contested in the primaries of ODM nominations for Nyandu constituency but he lost to Frederick Outa 
in the year 2008 Miguno Miguna became an advocate in Kenya. He served as a senior advisor and chief strategist to Rayla Odinga from the year 2006 until the year 2009. He later became a senior advisor on coalition, constitutional and legal affairs to then Rayla who was the prime minister. His relationship with ODM leader Rayla became sour and on August 2011 he was suspended from his post and he later turned down an offer of reinstatement. In the 2017 general elections Miguna Miguna ran for the gubernatorial seat of Nairobi County but he finished fourth with Mike Sonko winning the seat. Miguna Miguna was deported to Canada after he commissioned Orange Democratic Movement Party leader Rayla Odinga swearing in ceremony at Uhuru Park. The government argued that Miguna Miguna had denounced his citizenship in the year 1998. His Kenyan passport was seized in the year 2018 and he was forced out of the country. Fred Matiani, who was the cabinet secretary for interior at that time, said that Miguna Miguna's Kenyan passport was seized because it has been issued irregularly and fraudulently. Government officials at that time added that Miguna Miguna did not disclose his Canadian citizenship when he applied for Kenyan passport in the year 2009. So his application was not valid, Miguna Miguna was in exile for years despite him acquiring court order to reinstate his Kenyan citizenship. Then an already published author of four other books, Disgraceful Osgard and other essays, Songs of Fire, Toes Half Tales. And Africa's volcanic song, Miguna launched his fifth book and first ever memoir on July 14, 2012 titled, Peeling Back the Mask, The Quest for Justice. His book Peeling Back the Mask received an enormous amount of backlash especially from Rayla's supporters. They felt like Miguna Miguna was painting the name of Rayla badly, so Rayla's supporters in Miguna Miguna's hometown of Nyando led by Fred Outa who was the area MP burnt Miguna Miguna's effigy and mock coffin and they sprinkled ashes into River Nyandu. Miguna Miguna was again attacked by Rayla's supporters during his various book promotion tours across the country. It is there where he coined the name Come Baby Come. As a result of this Miguna Miguna resigned as a life member of ODM party in September 2012. In the year 2013 he went ahead and supported Uhuru Kenyatta who was Rayla's rival for presidency. Later on in the year 2017 Miguna Miguna reunited with Rayla Odinga during the formation of opposition's national resistance movement when he took the name General.